Thursday, the toughest tournament in sports, live on Spike every Thursday night at 10 p.m. Eastern. From the Brent Event Center in Irvine, California, it's the Bellator Season 8 opener. Let's get right to it with the fight for the Bellator Featherweight World Championship, Patricio Pitbull versus the champion, Pat Curran. We thought this fight would be decided on the feet, and we were right. It was all about the boxing of these two fighters. Patricio Pitbull coming in, throwing big bombs, but Pat Curran answering with straight punches right down the center. Nice, tight combinations. And another thing, having been in deep water before, he got stronger as this five-round fight went further and further, and it was the champ, Pat Curran, taking a split decision victory to retain the title. Next up, a light heavyweight tournament quarterfinal round fight. Mihail Zayats versus the MMA legend, Babalu Sabral. You see here the spinning back fist by Mihail Zayats. That was the beginning of the end for Babalu. You see here finishing up with some ground and pound. Big John McCarthy saw enough at that point. Aggression from Mihail Zayats and great finishing instincts. He gets a big upset victory in Babalu's hometown, Southern California, and moves on to the semifinals. And there you see with that upset victory, confirmation that Mihail Zayats advances to the light heavyweight tournament final four. Our second world title fight of the evening, this for the lightweight title of Bellator, Rick Hahn versus the undefeated champion, Michael Chandler. And the ease of the takedown, that was the story in this fight. Michael Chandler picking up and throwing down the judo Olympian, Rick Hahn, physically dominant, aggressive from the outset, keeping Rick Hahn on the defensive, but it was here taking his back, both hooks in, that he sunk the rear naked choke. Look at the hip pressure of Michael Chandler. That was the end for Rick Hahn. A steamroller victory for Michael Chandler as he retains the title with a second round submission victory. Back then to the light heavyweight tournament quarterfinals, Jacob Noe versus Seth Petruzzelli. Petruzzelli trying for the takedown against Jacob Noe. Some strikes were exchanged throughout, but here his knee went out on this takedown attempt. Jacob Noe spinning around perfectly, getting good position and unloading on top. You see here, furious left hands. Referee gave Seth Petruzzelli plenty of chances to get back in it, but he was out in this fight, a TKO victory for Jacob Noe. He called it the biggest fight of his life, and Jacob Noe takes full advantage, advancing to the semifinals. And we conclude with a light heavyweight tournament quarterfinal round fight, Atenas Jambazov versus Emmanuel Newton. John Bozov starting off strong in the opening round, coming forward with power punches. Emmanuel Newton playing the counter striker, landed some good right hands, but just too much energy expended in that first round by John Bozov, and that's when Emmanuel Newton turned it on. You see here taking the back, rear naked choke. He gets another rear naked choke victory. Great submission by Emmanuel Newton. So three places this evening have been filled in the light heavyweight tournament final four. Mihail Zayats, Jacob Noe, and Emmanuel Newton. For the latest Bellator news and information, it's bellator.com.